Hi, welcome to another video regarding MRCS exam. It is a question and answer session. Here the question. Which of the vessels listed below is the most inferiorly seated single aortic branch? So here we can see which is the most inferiorly seated single aortic branch. So we have to find out the abdominal aorta, then it is branches of the aorta, then we have to find out the branch which lies the most inferiorly and it is single. So here are the options, common iliac artery, inferior mesenteric artery, superior mesenteric artery, gonadal artery and median sacral artery. So we have to find out one of the option which is compatible with the answer that means which of the artery is the most inferiorly of the abdominal aorta and it is single branch so here in this picture this one picture is enough to realize all the criteria of the question here we can see the most inferiorly here this is the artery this is the median sacral artery and this median sacral artery here we can see it is the most inferiorly seated and it is single branch we can see other branches such as here 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 they are the paired branch so they will not be the answer and at the same same time the abdominal aorta is the most important topics for mrcs exam from the abdominal section so we know that the abdominal aorta it starts from the thoracic 12 vertebra where it leaves the thorax through the diaphragm through the aortic foramen and it ends at the level of the lumbar four vertebra and within this period or uh, within in this course the aorta gives lo a lot of branch almost all branches and see here other branches such as the anterior branch anterior branch first of all celiac trunk then superior mesenteric artery then inferior mesenteric artery so anterior branch anteriorly three branches celiac trunk superior mesenteric artery and inferior mesenteric artery and two terminal artery here right common iliac artery and left common iliac artery so anteriorly three artery terminal two artery then lateral branch four pairs of the lateral branch are present here we can see the inferior pharyngeal artery, then medial suprarenal, then renal and gonadal. So these four pairs are lateral branch and some of the posterior branches such as the lumbar vertebra. Here we can see the lumbar artery, first, second, third and fourth lumbar arteries and median sacral arteries. So our answer the median sacral artery and this median sacral artery, it is the posterior branch of the abdominal aorta and it is most inferior and it is single here we can see the vertebral level of the branches such as the inferior phrenic inferior phrenic vertebral level thoracic 12 celiac trunk thoracic 12 so this two vertebral level also important inferior phrenic celiac then we can see superior mesenteric artery lumbar on middle suprarenal lumbar on renal lumbar on uh, between the lumbar on and lumbar 2 so superior mesenteric lumbar one middle suprarenal lumbar one and renal between the lumbar one and lumbar two then gonadal we can see here the gonadal is lumbar two lumbar it arises from the uh, from lumbar one to lumbar four total four pairs then inferior mesenteric it is lumbar three level median sacral lumbar four and common iliac lumbar four and almost all of the particular level in this slide is the most important and we have to remember all the level and it is relatively easy if we see here here we can see the vertebra and if we see the branches and correlate with the branch with the vertebra level it will be very easy to memorize and answer that question so our final answer this is the most inferiorly seated single aortic branch is the median sacral artery thank you all.